today I'm going to be showing a demonstration of a DataCap application using Google Vision API for handprint, IBM Business Automation Content Analyzer for analysis, layout, and identifying key value pairs that allows us to populate index values from scanned images within your environment. Our client interface we're using is IBM DataCap Navigator. And for, this, for the purpose of this demo, we're using a manual scan and a manual verify. This process can be automated completely from beginning to end, but for the purpose of this demo, we'll be using two manual steps in the process. The Google Vision actions and the IBM Business Automation Content Analyzer actions will be run behind the scenes with page ID using Roll Runner. So the sample images we're going to be using are three different types. We'll be using this one for policy number, main policy number, this one for a secondary policy number, and this form for a policy number in a completely different location. So we have three different formats that we'll be working with today. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Now typically you can run these as a one large batch having it pull all your documents in at one time. But for the purpose of this demo, we're going to do one document at a time so that we can witness the different tasks that the, the actual document goes through in order to be processed. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with my first image. And so we'll go ahead and take our first image and we'll scan it in. Now, depending on the size of the content, it could scanning could take a little bit longer. Google Vision Processing could take a little bit longer. And IBM Business Automation Content Analyzer could take longer. I'm working on a single development system, so mine is a little bit slower. But highly robust systems would be able to process this fairly quickly. So we're going to go ahead and submit our first document. And then while we're waiting on that one, we're going to go ahead and bring another one in. So let's go ahead and grab this one. And kind of mix it up a little and we'll scan that one in and we're bringing our document types in as other and then they'll get classified in order to be able to be submitted to BACA or business automation content analyzer BACA for short and then let's go ahead and bring our next document in get all these going scan it in And then we'll submit that one. Now, while this is going on, you can see we've got a couple things going on here. We've already got one going to Google Vision. We've got one up in BACA already. And we've got another one going to Google Vision. So from Google Vision, they'll next go to Page ID. And from Page ID, they then proceed to BACA. And then BACA renders the results back at which the key value pairs are extracted for the documents. So great, now we've got one in Verify. We see that the, the Google Vision has now gone to Page ID, and the next step after Page ID will be BACA processing, and we see that happening now. And the same process will happen for the image above that. But let's go ahead and take a look at the, the image that's already in Verify and ready to be looked at. So you see we have over here our policy number. The policy number corresponds to the policy number in the third section of the document. Now you'll notice we do have spaces in between that because we are picking up actual format for this document. So Google Vision was able to interpret this and when it was received back by DataCap, BACA was able to say, okay, this is a policy number and bring it back and we were able to populate the field. So we'll go ahead and put that one back on hold. And let's get a refresh here. We've got another one pending, so let's go ahead and start this one. Now this is the one where we're pulling the primary policy number, which is this number in this field. Now you do have the ability to propagate all of these fields, depending on what you're looking to, to get out of your documents, your handwritten documents. You can grab basically any field in the format and send it up to Google Vision and have it identify hand printing in a document and then have it sent back down and then have BACA do the layout in your key value pairs for you. And then our third document. So once again, the policy number, 
which corresponds to the policy number. And once again, we are using spaces in here because we're picking up actual format. So that's basically how simple it is to get handwritten text out of multiple form layouts and documents and have them processed and grab the key value pairs in computer print format and have your data fields populated so that you can submit them to any of your back-end repositories. I hope you enjoyed this demo and have a great day.